Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my AJ Play, some more PGA Tour 2K23. We're in the Play Math underscore E underscore J Society, where we're playing an Earth, of course, um, which is Balsam Wood by Krabby Patty 09. Another one recommended to me by my boy Mike Heron. It's in my society. Feel free to join my society, guys. It'd be nice to get some more players in here. So this is Balsam Wood is a par 71, 18 holes playing 8,000 just shy of 8,000 yards but there are four pins and four tees the red tees to the gold tees and the gold tees will play 7,274 yards which will be the tees we play on as always we set to the default conditions which will be fairways normal greens firm green speed fast weather overcast and Saturday morning so this is balsam wood by Krabby Patty 09 let's get it underway let's go Going to be playing a couple of these boys from my society this week as well in an alt shot match. Just a bit of warm up. I'm entering an alt shot competition again. I'm very glad to so have with um, my boy off, Jamie, Geordie nice Boy, another great designer in the Let's game. So in the middle of the fairway and take it from there. Let's see how that gets on. But okay, let's have a look at this beautiful looking first hole. I like the Alps scene. You know the snowy mountains. 373 yards. Mm, do you know what? I'm gonna. Play back of that bunker. I got a feeling they're playing here. I'm going to hit that bunker. This is risky. Let's cover the bunker. Let's cover it. Great swing on that one. Should cover that bunker and just sit down in the fairway up there. So that's fine. It's a right decision. Going to leave us either a flop or a pitch up. Let's see. And second shot here on the first. 45 yards. I think I have a 46 yard flop. So let's hit that. Hit it straight up. Perfect strike. Should kick into that hill and slow down. That's a glorious shot in to this first hole. 171 green speeds are going to be interesting. But there we go. One and a through one. Lovely opening hole. And we follow the opener with a par five second. Yeah, I do like the something around the course set in the the snowy mountains with the the big pines. It's just a nice, it feels like a nice tranquil setting for me. There's two of the boys I'm playing with. I think later today, actually, Ohio State Mike. Here we go. Par and super wake. Ahead of you. Let's see what happens. Have a little old shot. There so 500 yard par five second. Lovely river off there to the right. Hopefully, we play alongside that at some point. Second shot here on hole number oh, two. Oh, we have a shot in there. Let's let's go for full loft. I don't think I think we're going to kick into here and end up around here with this wind. But no, my feet like that. We're not going to play that far right. Now the wind and everything should bring it back, but we're just going to stop short. I can't see us getting up onto the green from there. It's going to be a chip. Third shot. Chip for an eagle. Hit that a bit hard. So. But it catches the pin. I have, as I've said before, I've gotten way better at my chipping. And that's two under, three under through two. That's a great start. Beautiful little chip. Boom. Lovely. Okay. I used to hate leaving myself chips, but now... I don't mind. I'm making way more of them three under par. okay three under through two mike's at three through five super wigs even through one yeah, nice course so far so my society runs now guys you have a weekend so friday to monday so this is the last day to play this and there'll be a new course now up from tomorrow to friday so i'm doing two a week now where before i only had one a week so more courses, more showcases, more opportunity for you guys to come in and play. Check it out. Or don't. Entirely up to you. So, third is a par four. We are 130 yards out. 30 foot up. 10 mile per hour wins. So it's around 150. 150 is a club with a touch of loft. Should put us on the pin. If we can hit it clean, which we can. And it should be around the pin. 
It's a nice shot. Well judged approach there. So right, if we can keep this the let's start going. It's gonna turn hard at my feet. So this putt's tracking. Which it does, and then straightens up. That was a fantastic shot. It's a glorious little putt. And we have four under through three. And a par three up next. Is it gonna be a two hundred yard one or a little short one? Let's find out. Nice course so far, though. 163. Decent yardage. I like these ones. Kind of the yardage you'd expect. For a par 3. So we're going to be a little loft and a little spin on the 162 that I got in my hand. A little slow, little push. Going to even each other out. That actual that push is taking me further left than I expected. But right yardage. But it's not going to make it up that hill, sadly. With the slope. That's safe. This one for the birdie. So, little tricky foot uphill putt. Breaking hard left to right and then coming back at the pin. So, let's blast it up this hill. Won't take as much of the break. And it should just turn back oh, as we reaches on, the hole. Which it does. Going. That's two birdies in a row. Let's have a third. Okay, I think from those 20 foot, that. Let's see 20, 20 to 30 foot putts, I class myself as one of the better ones in the game from those distances. Not so great close up <laughs> and further away, I'm not so great either. But from around that yardage, 20 to 30 feet, it's because I could leave myself most of those putts, 20 to 30 feet putts. So, but I'm pretty good at them. I'm um, in a CGA division I play in. Um, they track stats like that, and I was the leading long putter in the last tournament. That drive's looking decent and here. And I'm top three for the season, I think, overall. We are about 140 yards out. So, another lovely par four. Lovely scenery. A little waterfall over there feeding the river that goes through the course. So, 139 has got to be perfect. I'm not going to go that far left because of my tendency to push and fast things. That was the right decision. 98% power just killed that. 100% power, and I was all over that nice. pin. And here's an eight footer. But we're eight us. foot away. Looking pretty good. And we get it. You are looking at a six under. And we've started hot. We have come in hot. Six under through five. It's an incredible round so far on this beautiful course. And we are on the sixth hole now. Oof! This is a. Uh interesting one so if you play down here you could canter into that river so easily with a headwind you can probably clear that but i'm going to play up here today um give myself a shot across this lovely river what a beautiful what a beautiful course thank you mike appreciate it i have had a designer reach out so i'm going to put a couple of his courses in my society um over the next following weeks i do like it when Designers reach out and ask me to play their courses, and I will duly oblige, my friends. So that push is going to just take me slightly left of the hole again. I've developed that because I have to push up to the left to get it straight, but I'm just pushing too far left at the minute. So is it going to take as much of this break as I'm thinking? Let's play. No, I, yeah, I, did. I had a feeling I also didn't. My swing line was terrible on that part as well, but okay, on yeah, next. I didn't think it was. I don't know why. One seventies don't okay. tend to take as much break. In at six under but it was six through six. I started to drop a shot there. Mike's at the turn at six under. Is upon us. Oh, oof, oof. this is not fun. I'm gonna hit the one ninety three. I don't know if this gets there, but. Anything else feels too long. It's going to stay out to the right because of that swing line. Probably catch this little hill by here. Yeah. Didn't think that was enough, but the 215 was way too long. So I was kind of betwixt Here's and between there. But we have a 47 footer. Feels like the course has just stepped up the difficulty with the elevation and the, the long par threes. That's just going to overturn. 
and not have the legs either. But okay, I'll take that on a 230 yard par 3. I will take a par. I feel like you've got to take your medicine sometimes in this game. Thankfully, I'm off my medicine now. I am just dealing with the pain myself from my back, guys. So, lovely. Well done. What I would call the standard par four. Yards to the pin from here. I got a 125, so I'm going to hit that. Off the lead. I think this is going to be okay, even though it's 35 feet up. I just have a feeling, touch a deal off maybe, that this should be okay. I've hit that perfectly. Oh, wow, no, that's not okay. Wow. Well, I've been caught out with the... Uh, so yesterday I was playing when it was 30 foot up. I was playing a 10 feet, 10 yards go. past Step and the green side rough. got flying straight past. This one when I had a I had a tailwind behind me there. It was uphill. I was already playing yardage past the cup. And it just it died. Just died. 101% power and it didn't even reach the green. Nice and easy. Well done. Well, here's what it is. Drops. There's your par. It's the beauty of golf. Misreading the elevation like that. One. Six under through eight. Come on, let's get the seven at the turn. Let's get the seven at the turn. Keep the pressure on Mike, who's at seven through 11. The classic the seven, nine. 11. Seems to be a split I like in this game quite a lot too. So we're going to deal off this. 546 yard par five. So let's deal off this a little bit more. Just get it into the nice fairway and give there. ourselves a shot of the green. Don't want to run off the end. What a beautiful, what a beautiful course just playing okay, this river meandering place. through it with all the little waterfalls it looks glorious it's just a, these designers are just geniuses i love it right now on the last one i didn't hit it long enough this to me is saying it's playing 213 but i'm not here at 215 i know there's a backstop if i'm short i can chip it on that's the play here if i'm short i'm going to chip it on now just put a bit of spin on that guys because spin adds distance to my five iron Oh, that slow is going to kill me again. 102% uh, power, still that short. That's a shame, but the slow probably added to that. But that's disappointing. It should come around to the left, but I don't think I hit it hard enough. Nope, just catching a few slows. But all right, we get the birdie, which is what you want on a short par five. Nice way to round out this front nine. Seven under through nine. Mike's at eight through 12. Look like super weak. That came in at the first and thought, not today. See what you can do here on the tenth hole. Let's go. Eight. Oh, if you had a headwind on this, mm. gonna play the two fifty eight down here. Don't want to run out of runway. <laughs> I know it's a fairway, but you know. Okay. 72 in, 67, down 7. I'm going to touch a D loft and touch a f spin. This should be carrying it perfectly anyway on this down slope. That's a horrible strike, and that's going to go way long. Did not need the D loft. I was on a down slope. I called it myself. When I said on this down slope in my head, I thought, why would I put D loft on it? Done now, though. Tricky putt back. It's heading towards the hole. Oh, glorious putt. Glorious putt. And we're eight under. Two birdies on a bounce after three pars on a bounce and a par three coming up on the 11th. And after that one, you're sitting at eight under. And we are eight under. So we are not going to do the classic 7 11. Mike's at eight through 13. Have fun here on this par three. Me and Mike do have ding dong battles in his society and my society. Let's go. So 180 yards. 29 foot up, but again, I'm going to ignore. It might be the wrong decision. Great swing. I'm going to ignore that elevation this time. And this time it worked in my favor. Last time it didn't. It came well short. This time ignoring it was the right move. Okay, so on the green safely. You never know. This one's 17 feet. Oh. 
Let's go. This is a bit of a bit of a bit of a curler, bit of a bandit like back and putt. But oh, do we ever! Wonderful work out there. So far. it's wonderful work, John. It is wonderful work, and we got a par five coming up. Okay, nine under. On this quite score. tranquil, tranquil course, set in the backdrop of the snowy peaks. 588 yard par 5. Gotta make this fairway. So, hopefully, the shaping I put on will keep that kicking up. Yeah. Didn't want that to kick right. Oh. We're gonna play for this left hand side, guys. So, I don't wanna know anything about going off this hill. So, we're playing up here, and hopefully, it comes round. We're literally, literally playing up there. I was hoping to catch, be a bit further right and catch that hill down. So we're going to have a horrible putt now down here. Careful with this one. This is this is going to be way. horrific. This is what you call a, a one in a hundred. Let's go. Oh, nowhere near enough break on that. <laughs> That's not bad, actually. It's not a bad effort. It did start to come back. And this putt for the birdie. That was not a bad effort. Could only Keep lag putt when you play. you're up there like that. Not there. a lot I could do. Just make sure I don't okay, putt off the green. One, you're sitting right there at ten under. Ten under through twelve though. Ohio State's at ten through fifteen. So he is keeping Keep pace just a couple of holes ahead of us. Play the one eighty three here. With some loft and spin. Hit it true. Oh, that was a fine swing, oh, that fine was a fine swing. swing, John. It's going to be long, though, sadly, even at 98% power. But I put a bit of loft and spin on it, so hopefully it sits down quick, quick ish. Okay, we're on the green. Not bad. And Not bad effort. 14 feet to go. Let's go. 14 feet, two inches down. With a, a little curly whirly one again. If we got the read line. again, oh, we do. And we are reading on. greens like a demon right now. And that is five birdies on the bounce. Par 4, 14th up next. Let's keep this going. Guys, hopefully you are enjoying my content. Um, it's going into more of the course playthrough, you know, in my society. But this is where I put all the courses I want to play. Um, so, yeah, if you are enjoying, please do like. As I say, please hit me up if you've got any courses you want to see me play. If anything else you want to see on the channel, let me know. Any content you'd like me to cover. Always happy to give it a go. I do try to engage in my community too, as I said. Got an alt shot match coming up this evening against a few of the boys from the society. Just enjoying and enjoying my golf again. I didn't I went off the game for a bit. So I think I'm gonna have to hit the 125 here with a touch of loft and touch of spin. And I've absolutely butchered that. That <laughs> <laughs> uh, I watched um, Apex Sound yesterday and he did the same thing. His thumb just slipped. My thumb just slipped off the, the controller. Sometimes it doesn't register. That time it gave me that hard slow. And that has put us in an awkward situation down here. So, oh, that didn't come out as far as I thought it would. Oof. Could drop a shot on this hole. After being 130 yards away as well, that's not what you want. Generally for I've done all right there. This is gonna move left and then should come back to the right. Oh, oh it didn't move back. All right, for the bogey. Oh, all right, moving forward. Just as I was saying I was playing some good golf <laughs> and enjoying my time. We drop a and shot on Ohio State Mike and now we're gonna have to go some to catch him. Leader here today. Final round of play. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. You're not wrong, my friend. I'm gonna hit the two fifteen. Now, oh, that pulling Come on, get fast, one. and it should run left to right. Oh, it just ran straight. Nice oh. on the green. Okay. This putt is a about Not bad, though, for a 230-yard par 3. We have a putt at it. We'll be making these for fun all round. There. We're still We're making them for fun. This one after a bogey on the Look at that scorecard. Well all circles and just a rogue square. I clearly like my shapes. And after that, when you're sitting at 11 under. 
Let's go 11 through 15. And you're teeing up on a par four for this one. Oh, the 16th. You, if you could play up this channel, you're laughing, but that's a tricky shot. Down here is the safe play. So we're going to play down here. This is the safe shot. Going to give you a longer shot in, but it gives you flat, flat feet. Good one. Ish, not that flat. Yards away. There Never we go. So close. One stroke. So again, do I hit the one twelve, or do I believe in a distance here and hit the one twenty-five? I'm going to believe in a distance here and hit the one twenty-five. This time, I feel that the distance is true. Got a because uh, I super slowed it last time I tried to hit this club. This I really, well. really shoved that forward so fast to get that was to so leader. bad i'm gonna put this i'm gonna put this i don't want to put past that hole or look at it it all just runs off the green so i've got to be careful here this is a delicate delicate one and i've hit that quite hard so this has got to turn and hit the pin oh nice work <laughs> on that one that uh Went a long way to get home. Beautiful putt. And yeah, I think we're gonna have to beautiful have putt. Look at that one. Just took the break perfectly. Oh, glorious! And after that one, twelve under par. Okay, twelve under, tied with Mike. I'm assuming. Now, can we surpass him? Two holes to go. One of which I think is a par five. Nice tee shot and land it nicely in that so par four, seventeenth. No mistakes here. Play straight down the middle of this fairway. Nice wide open fairway. It's going to kick on and down. Kicked a little more left than I would have liked then. Setting up here. Squeaky from butt time. Green. Mm. Going to loft the one seventy three. This might be dangerous. Dangerous game. Oh, that's a terrible swing look at that swing and the fast that uh, yeah that was not that's not the, the right game, call so we're not getting it's the winning birdie here third shot well we get it on the next hole what we got to make sure of here is that we don't throw away a shot Oof. okay let's blast this at the hole looking good okay was a good putt. so as always i seem to always leave it to the last hole that bogey did that to me and that par has just ruined my my shapes. My OCD is not happy. But we have a par five finisher Currently 12 under par. on this lovely little course at Balsam Wood. Check it out, guys. Give it a play. Deserves it. Luck as you bring this one home. 582 yards this up one. this hill. So I'm going to loft this a little bit. Try and get it up there. Oh man, did you ever uh -oh. send that one? I sent it straight at the bunkers, John, but luckily the loft and spin I put on it cleared them. We have 258 in. If I hit this, am I? Yeah, it's uphill. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit the 258. It's not gonna get there, but I'll just fall in this area here. I will loft and spin this too. My feet were so awkward then. I should clear that. And end up in that area and it gives us a chip and a putt for the win but also just enjoying this course the chip felt good oh sorry just sneezed there this left okay for a final score of 58. can i ask for a better putt this putt's good so far. To get to 13 under, a 58. And that back nine was eventful. Some beautiful golf, guys. Thank you for watching. Appreciate all the support and the love. Please do feel free to like. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe. And I will catch you later in the week for some more course playthroughs. Cheers, folks.